Good, how are you? Oh. Huh? Where? Oh, yeah, the old one. Yard sellers every, every year. How you doing this year? Oh, doing okay. Hey, we're going to remember, I told you I had those weeds I was going to sell uh -huh. and stuff. Uh -huh. We're going to have our yards that we're going to try to have it toward the end of April. It'll be on Facebook. Okay. okay. We live behind Crackle Barrel. Awesome. That sounds good. My first one, too. We're excited. Yeah, I said, oh, it's cold, but I'm still going. Mm -hmm. We had one. We make sure in there. Oh, yeah, I'm just seeing if there's anything. Cool. My son's uh, only had his PC uh, gaming system for probably four months, and he's been really and he paid three thousand dollars for it. Yep. How much are your consoles? Uh, yeah. uh, I think my buddy just bought it. <laughs> yeah, he called and he said he bought a PS2 and a Wii. Does, I'll find out for him. Okay. Yeah, because I think it's still kind of hot, but you've got something to do with it. Babe. Ooh, it's pretty cute. What is that? PlayStation 3. Oh, it works. PlayStation 3 here, uh -huh. I guess it's this one. Uh, she says she was, it works, but when you go to hook it up to the TV, mm -hmm. something about it, she couldn't get it to come on. Okay. But it worked, but she couldn't get it, to, I guess, connect to the TV. Okay. Sorry, honey. You're fine. She says she's at 25 for it, I think. Where are you offering for it all, huh? I uh, well, I'm interested in that bin too, just because there's controllers and stuff in there. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Uh, I mostly just want the controllers and the connect and stuff, but I didn't feel like digging through it all because it's all tangled up. <laughs> uh, uh, I just want the, I'm just interested in the consoles. You can keep the games. For this one, I would do like, uh, just because he says it's not working, I would do like 15 bucks. But for this one here, I would do like 30 bucks if you want that. So 45, and then maybe another $10 for the bin and stuff. That's fine. Cool. So 45, mm -hmm. I'm pay him real quick. There's 40. I think I got a five. It's fine. Alrighty. Appreciate it. I'm just going to leave it sitting here for a second. Okay. Keep looking around. Yeah. <coughs> uh, well, yeah, I think my buddy said there's one up by Shooter's Roost somewhere up there. By the, by the bus garage. And then. Across from. Uh, oh, up there by yeah, the. Yeah, it's right up 60 right up here on the right. By Mason, by Masana, come across from the. You know if these cameras work? I'm not for sure on them. Would you do like five bucks for the pair? There's just two of them here. So I appreciate it. I thought they were stupid. I think they're hot like you know. Right. How about for your like shoes? How much are your shoes? Like $2 a piece. <clears throat> Here, I'll grab these boots. Let's see what those are. Those are Season, baby. First season, baby. First season. Doing it. Four USB port. I know. PS3. Yeah. 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 
You don't have any like video games or anything, game consoles, any of that kind of stuff? Uh, <laughs> I got a PS3, I don't know how many games are with it. Uh, is it, is it like the Super Slam, the Slam, do you know? I don't know, what kind is it, Danny? Flat. The PS3 you all sold us? I don't remember. I can take a look at it if you want to bring, bring, pull it out. Thank you. It's the Slim, does it work and everything? Yeah, it does work. My kids usually play it, but I bought them switches, so they oh, okay. stop playing. Yeah, well, yep, then they're done with this. <laughs> does it, uh, yeah, d how many controllers do you have, you know? Uh, two, I think. Two. Two or three. You want to go find all the stuff? <laughs> okay. And tell Logan to grab all the games you can find for us. Those are the games we have got with it. Two controllers. And then I don't have the charging cords for the controllers. That's fine. And there's three more games in here. Uh, Tony Hawk Pro Skater. Uh, Fear. And Lego Marvel Superheroes. <coughs> you know how much you'd want for all of it? You have uh, price in mind. Give me, your, give me your best price where you can still make money because I know where, where this is going. Yeah. Uh, so I usually, I mean, I'll just be honest with you. None of these games are anything crazy, of course, but I usually get about... Uh, one ten for these when I sell them on Amazon. So um, the extra controller helps me out because I've got like ten of these sitting at home that I can't send in because of the controllers. So I usually <clears throat> I would offer you like, do you have PayPal? Does anyone have PayPal? She does. Okay. Um, I would offer you like uh, for everything like sixty bucks. <clears throat> Seventy-five with the extra controller. I do seventy with the extra controller. That's cool because I I give you ten that. bucks for a controller typically. So right, cool. Thank you guys, y'all have a good one. Thanks for pulling out for us. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. We went to our first yard sales of the season today. We're very excited. It's still like 40 something degrees, I don't even know. But there were a lot of people out and we had a lot of sales actually. I was surprised. There were like we were probably five or six. Today. No, we had no plans to go today. And then we woke up and saw some sales and we were like, well, let's do this. So at the first sale, I'm gonna go over everything. Got some crazy stuff and some things you didn't see, so you're gonna to wanna to stick around. So, at the first sale, I walked up and there was this Xbox and PS3. And you can see right there, one, two, three, four, four USB ports, which means that this PS3 is backwards compatible, which means it's worth probably around 300 bucks, maybe a little more on Amazon. So, haven't sold one in a while, so I'm not 100% sure but probably at least 300 bucks on Amazon as well, after fees, maybe 350. Um, did have a controller, which is great. DualShock 3s are so difficult to find. And then there's this Xbox 360 and this bin of stuff. And you can see there's like one, two, three. There's like three Xbox 360 controllers in here, a Kinect, a bunch of other stuff. And we got all that stuff for 45 bucks. So a great deal there. Of course, you'll see what this is gonna go for on Amazon. Uh, we also got some boots, um, these Justins here. Always look out for these. They don't look like they've been worn too much, but uh, they got a little bit of wear on them, as you can see, which is actually really good for resale. Uh, we paid $2 for those, and those will probably go for like 40, I would imagine. And then these Laredos, these are super nice. So I think they've been worn, but not very much. <clears throat> paid two bucks for those as well. And I think that those were going for like 60 to 70, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, Hannah found these little radios yeah they're like radios that go on your arm i guess and there are two of them they go for how much like eight to ten a piece eight to ten each and we paid for a dollar yeah, a dollar for both so found these d-link cameras these are about i think they were like 40 bucks a piece uh is what they go for we paid a dollar each i think so not a bad deal there um got this ps3 here we asked this was on an ask uh he pulled out some games these and the ps3 Two controllers which is great and then that bird is having a real good time <laughs> and then he uh 
he said he just kind of said you know i know what you're going to do with it make me a fair offer I offered him 60 bucks he said 75 i said 70 and we got made a deal on 70 bucks so i'll probably get like 125 for the playstation but the extra controller allows me to send another one of my playstations in so the controller is probably worth 25 so we paid about half um and then all these games as well which nothing really good there maybe black ops 2 is decent uh at the very last sale, oh yeah, this thing. So we bought this keys thing. I'm not exactly sure, but it's pretty cool. So it's got a bunch of keys down in there and you can see it's, I, don't, I can't tell what that says. This says office, this says home, this says tire and the keys like flip out. And we've been looking into more antique type items because we've been selling a lot at the auction house. Um, so for those that don't know, we did cancel our booth. It just became way too much work and not enough money in it, guys. Um, we weren't. How far we were driving. Yeah, it was like an hour drive, so we weren't able to go as much as we wanted to. Um, so we started doing stuff at an auction house here in town, and we've been doing pretty well there so far. Got a lot of stuff going up, and um, eventually I want to do a video of some of our things going up for auction. But you did do the one with the decanters. Yeah, but actually go to the auction and do it. Oh, yeah. yeah. But this is going to be an item for the auction, I think. I think he's going to like this and uh, throw it in there. It's it's very cool. So We'll see. All right, at the last sale, we picked up these two boxes here for 20 bucks total. It's got a bunch of whatever the heck these things are. Uh, I don't know. I don't even know what they are, guys. Hubble wiring device. Kill them, son. I, I don't know. So I scanned the barcode on this one. And this thing is full of them, uh, but I scanned the barcode on this and it was going for about $13 a piece. And you can see there are a ton in here. There's a bunch of open ones as well, um, but there are a lot. So these are probably, you know, they're little breaker box things, I don't know. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, circuit breakers. Um, but I don't, I don't know, we'll go through this whole box and kind of figure out what it's worth, but I would say it's probably at least $100, $200 worth of stuff in there. Um, and then this, this was probably the find of the day. Um, these Fomoco PPT 20 modules for like Fords. Um, there's a lot of them down in here. So quite a few. And then there's more down in here. And then there's a, whatever this thing is. And then all that stuff. So I, I don't know. We haven't went through the whole box, but a lot of these were selling for like 30 to 40 bucks a piece. And there's, like I said, there's quite a few of them in here. So. We'll go through that whole box and see what it's worth as well. But yeah, overall, not a bad day. All right, guys, thanks for watching. We're so glad Yard Sale Season's back. There should be weekly uploads coming back. Uh, we are actually finally in the process of moving. We are cleaning up the house, getting it ready to go, and then we're going to be moving. We bought some land, and we're planning on building a house here in the next year or so. So you guys can come along on that journey as well. And again, thanks for watching. We appreciate it. Sorry there haven't been any videos. But uh, we're glad to be back and glad to be doing some more yard sailing. So we'll catch you guys in the next video.